Hello Capricorn! Welcome to your reading Capricorn. Let's see what Spirit wants you to know. What do we have for you Capricorn? Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and North Node. Okay, this is a collective reading for your sign Capricorn, general reading. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your situation. Let's see. We have social media. Okay, what else we have for Capricorn, please? It might be a case, Capricorn, that you are posting things or maybe you're active on the social media. Whatever the case might be, I'm getting that someone here is uh, keeping tabs on you. They are following you on social media. They're watching your stories. It might be a case that you have here a sign. So you might be dealing with another Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo, and this earth sign, it, it, they, they are posting a lot in order to kind of get your attention. But social media here, this card is showing up for a reason maybe for some of you you are uh, in touch with 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 an earth sign for some of you with another earth sign it doesn't have to be an earth sign but it's showing up here very very strongly this person might have placements you know Taurus Virgo Capricorn in their chart we have music oh okay I'm getting here so this this kind of energy that someone for instance if you are in touch here with someone it might be a case that this person is sending you songs, okay? This is how they're expressing their mood or this is how they're expressing their feelings that they have for you. Or they are posting um, videos or they are talking about music through social media. But it is kind of, um, it is done on purpose in order to gain your attention. I'm getting also that you might be receiving signs from the universe for music. For some of you, music is very important in your life. You might be musician, artist, dancer, paint, mm, painter, uh, member of the band, singer, right? Artist, uh, artistically um, gifted. What else we have for Capricorn, please? Thank you. We have perspective. Do we have another one? No, we don't. I thought we did. Okay. We have perspective. So someone here is seeing you Capricorn differently. You know, they've changed their mind with the winter. I'm getting Capricorn that so it might be a case for some of you that someone made some sort of judgment and now they are regretting it they had a time they thought about the situation and they looked this they looked at you or situation involving both of you differently it's like they changed perspective with this perspective um, card I'm also getting that you, Capricorn, yourself, it might be a case that um, with this winter card, which essentially is showing me that someone here is trying to detach, and I'm getting this is your energy, trying to distance yourself from, from, from certain individuals here or situation. And with the winter card, for some of you, it might be a case that you stopped being active on social media because winter is this energy of of withdrawal right going within and not being very active but either way social media here it's quite this card is sending out for you capricorn someone it might be a case that someone is trying to gain your get your attention through social media meaning they posting music or they posting certain things <coughs> excuse me or they are keep on here they are trying to keep on tabs on you they're trying to figure out or find out what you're up to 
because earth energy is very grounding <clears throat> oh my gosh someone wants to talk but they they feel unable to express themselves this is this person and here's the thing capricorn that you might be feeling that deeply inside that you that you have this inner knowing that this person is that you are still on their mind but with the winter card i feel that at the moment it might be a case for some of you that um <sighs> there are so many messages is showing up here you know december january february february might be quite important for your situation for some of you there is no contact situation with someone okay i'm giving many scenarios as it is a collective reading for your sign capricorn i'm getting what one group here uh, it's showing up someone it's 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 coming forward here through through someone's energy is coming through the, through through these cards as they might be in touch through so, social media and someone here is sending songs in order to kind of express their feelings that's how they do it you might be dealing with the another earth sign here capricorn taurus virgo taurus virgo another capricorn right and for some of you it might be a case that you know you would draw your energy because uh, you wanted to kind of think about certain situations see things from a different perspective and you are not very active on social media but another person here it's trying to figure out what you're up to Mm. okay let's see let's see capricorn mm. i'm i'm getting very strong cross watcher energy <sighs> cross watcher you might feel that this is your reading okay and that capricorn is involved in this situation okay so the roles can be switched like you know reverse or kind of a vice versa you know what i mean that kind of feeling but i'm getting very strong cross watches energy yeah mm -hmm. okay let's try let's see because this energy is very strong let's see could you please show me important messages for capricorn could you please show me overall energy for Capricorn, please? You see, way too many. Could you please show me overall energy for Capricorn? Thank you. We have the lovers. Might be dealing with Gemini, Capricorn. Overall energy for Capricorn, please. Oh, it's very strong, this energy. Page of Pentacles, yeah. I'm getting very strongly here, Capricorn that there is a potential here for some sort of co connection knight of swords why the lovers and page of pentacles justice seven of cups you you have here choices with the seven of cups capricorn choices in love decisions i'm getting here capricorn that someone here wants to chase you with this knight of swords and it might be a case that you will be receiving many messages with this page of pentacles because someone is very drawn to you and they want here connection relationship you might be dealing also with libra justice yeah this is someone here capricorn who wants to appear that they are fair someone who wants to gain your trust that's what i'm getting with the seven of cups and here is the thing as it comes to your overall energy with the seven of cups it might be a case that you, that you don't really it's not that you don't trust them but um this person might if, if you are in touch with someone okay uh, you might feel that something here is inconsistent or this person is changing mood it's like a, they have a mood swings 
or there is something or you might suspect that this person is trying to kind of uh, paint themselves in a better light that they, they, they are trying too hard that's what it's showing up here for me this is of course for someone who is in touch here with another individual if, if that's your story here Capricorn because this is a very very visible and quite you know quite strong energy this person uh, see they want to chase you they want to gain your trust they they I'm getting here for communication with this page of Pentacles you can expect some sort of form of an offer coming in also with this card because this person wants relationship you have someone here Capricorn who wants relationship with you if you haven't met this person the, you, you very soon you will meet someone here or you will be in touch you know you will be someone here will text you or you know send you a message something like this and this person wants to chase you with this knight of swords they want to gain your trust they want to appear at the, as that they are just that they are right for you with seven of cups i'm getting that you know you might come this person might come across for you that they just try too hard that it's just not like it's something very natural here that's why i'm getting you having many choices and to be quite precise choice in order to give into this situation or not i'm also getting for some of you indeed that there is a choice at the moment you might be facing some sort of important decision I'm also seeing you Capricorn standing up for yourself and kind of protecting your views and trying to prove a uh, certain some sort of kind of a that that you are right about something and I feel it is very important for you I, I like you protecting truth you're protecting that justice here with this knight of swords mm-hmm I'm getting also Capricorn that for some of you you want to get the bottom of the bottom of something because seven of cups is also energy of um, uncertainty doubt something here doesn't seem uh, clear and with this energy knight of swords and justice I feel that you want to, that you are very determined to get some sort of truth uh, to 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 get the bottom of something and to bring justice and fairness to the situation if that's the case um, with these cards I feel that there will be some sort of kind of understanding you will achieve understanding and you know with this page of Pentacles it's it might be a situation you know it might be something like um, for instance you might feel that it's not a lot because pages well, you know it's like potential but I'm seeing here that if there is a particular matter here Capricorn that you are kind of you are very determined to uh, stand up for yourself or to kind of find figure out or find out the truth about something okay uh, you will make progress with this page of Pentacles and at the end you will get there with the lovers but I'm seeing you having choices and there might be a certain decision that you might be facing at the moment. Uh, decision that uh, you might feel that you, you kind of, uh, uh, it's quite tricky with the Seven of Cups. Let's see Capricorn, your love life. Show me love life, Capricorn's love life. We have a Three of Pentacles. Thank you. And we have two of cups. We have a connection. Love. Three of pentacles. Someone here wants to put an effort. That's what I was getting. They want to prove themselves here. That they are worthy your trust. Three of pentacles to the two of cups. Why the three of pentacles and the two of cups for Capricorn? Two of Wands, okay, you might be mirroring each other. Seven of Pentacles. Why the three? Okay. 
Let me just pick up this card. Excuse me. It's a nice card. <laughs> we have an Ace of Cups. Very nice. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Knight of Wounds. Okay. So we have a Three of Pentacles to the Two of Pentacles. Clarified by the Two of Wands, Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. Capricorn. Uh, 2nd of February might be quite important. 7th of February, 1st of February, 3rd of February. <laughs> Gosh, I also have 2nd of March, 7th of March, 1st of March, number 22, number 27, number 21, Number 23, those numbers are showing up here, might be quite significant for you. And also those months that I've mentioned might be also quite important for your situation. Those numbers can be someone, someone's age or the age that person that you're dealing with or someone involved in the situation or someone important in your life. I'm also getting very strongly in 1972, 1971 and 90. Um, 73 those years Capricorn I'm seeing here someone who wants to work on the on, on this connection someone who is in love with you you have someone here who really wants to share this cup of love I'm getting For some of you, this is someone who is already invested in this connection with the Seven of Pentacles. With the Two of Wands, yes. I'm seeing someone planning for the future. They see future here with you, long term, Capricorn. For some of you, this is someone who wants to be given another chance. However, with this Ace of Cups, the majority of energy here is showing up that this is someone new. That this is like a new energy. You have here someone, Capricorn, who wants to prove themselves that they are worthy of trust, that they are a team player, that they, that they are the one who, that they are the person who is a team player, who, 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 who is able to compromise, who is able to kind of give you this equal gift take. Someone here is in love with you, Capricorn. They, they love you. They have plans. This is someone who, is, who, who, who wants to stay. They are not planning to go anywhere. With the Seven of Pentacles, yeah. this is someone who is invested emotionally in this connection, Capricorn. They do want to work on or put effort. I'm getting effort, dedication. This person wants to prove that they are worthy of your time and that they have so much here to offer. You have someone here, Capricorn, who is planning long term with you and they want to offer you this cup of love. They want to have connection, relationship. And we have, look, the two of cups and the lovers fairly next to each other with the ace of cups. For sure, this is the spirit is showing some 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 connection here, a very strong soul connection that you might be sharing with. It might be a case that indeed this is someone who you already know, someone who who is already invested, meaning someone from your past who wants to start over with the Ace of Cups. They want to kind of, I'm getting this sort of kind of you know. Re they want to reach out and maybe apologize for some of you, Ace of Cups. But mainly, Capricorn, for most of you, I'm getting new energy, someone new. Okay? As it is a collective reading, I need to read the cards collectively. But mainly, I'm getting this energy that someone new here who wants to chase you, who wants to prove themselves, who wants to be given a chance. And I'm getting here that you're, you're kind of, you might be seeing this person, oh my gosh, they're really trying, they're like trying too hard. 
I don't feel, again, this is something like, because of that sort of attitude, you might be feeling that this person, you know, that their intentions are not fully pure, you know. For some of you, you might be suspecting that this person has other options, that it's in touch with other people with the Seven of Cups. But to be perfectly honest with this energy, this is someone who wants you. They are focused on you, Capricorn. They want to offer you the cup of love. This person is planning to have a long-term relationship with you. They want to stay for a very, very long time in your life. So you have someone who wants you, who feels very passionate about you and about this connection. Could you please show me Capricorn's career and finances? Could you please show me Capricorn's career and finances? We have a King of Swords. You might be dealing Capricorn with Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. And we have Chariot. This is a Cancerian energy, like a major victory here over adversity is showing up with those two cards. I'm getting very strongly Capricorn that you will prove your point here to someone who has a tendency to be quite cold or they might appear that way. This King of, uh, I wanted to say King of Cups, okay. This King of Swords, it's, it's quite, it can, it can be a boss or supervisor, something like this manager, but they, they are quite, you know, quite straightforward. Let's see. King of Swords and the Chariot. Why the King of Swords and the Chariot? I'm seeing you being very victorious here, Capricorn, with this Chariot. This is an ultimate card of victory and success, progress, also proving your point. We have the world, we have a Four of Swords, okay. And we have a Hermit, a very solitude energy is showing up. Capricorn, you may be dealing with Virgo. I also have fixed energy. Taurus, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. I'm, I'm, I'm getting very strongly here, Capricorn, that for some of you, you might be quite tired at the moment. You know, might be... It can be a case for some of you that your current work-related situation might be quite draining because of this King of Swords attitude there's someone's attitude it's someone here might be particularly difficult or causing some sort of issues or obstacles here and with the four of swords and the hermit it's like you might feel i really need a break i really need to step back in order to recharge the batteries and to rethink my situation with the world i'm seeing for some of you that you might be taking uh, some time off especially next to the Four of Swords and Hermit. It might be something that you've already planned and it will, it will kind of, uh, it will happen fairly soon, right? Maybe you've already kind of uh, asked for, uh, for some of you, it might be a case that you decided to, to use your time that you had from a previous year, right? With the world, because it's like a completion for me. It's like a, uh, it's just my personal, you know, based on experience, like a year it can signify for me. For some people it might be 21 months as the number of the card, but I'm getting very strong intuitively here that it might be a case that for some of you, you didn't use uh, your days, the free days or days that you were, uh, that they were available for you to take, like a free days for holidays, something like this. And you might be thinking, oh my gosh, I really need to take some break. And with this world card, it might be a case that you have some extra days from a previous year. And, you know, uh, you have a possibility to use them. But I'm getting here someone who is taking uh, some time off. For some of you, you might be traveling here or your work-related situation involves traveling. If that's the case, I'm seeing you being quite tired, Capricorn. Four of Swords is like kind of here, major overall, kind of, you know, in the center. This Four of Swords is extending up here very strongly. Next to the Hermit, it is, this is like an energy of 
taking break, going within, thinking about the current situation involving, you know, your work related matters and just, you know, recharging batteries. It might be a case for some of you that, you know, you, you just have so much responsibilities and it's just, and then this king of swords here, this energy, right? Male, female, uh, it, it doesn't make things easier quite in the contrary I'm, I'm also getting here Capricorn that you might be um, slowly kind of thinking about this the whole situation here but I'm seeing you being tired just tired and wanting to kind of uh, withdraw at least for a minute I'm seeing you, Capricorn, also, again, overcoming some sort of adversity, obstacle issue with this, um, with this chariot card. And then we have the world, so it is like a major accomplishment. So there is some sort of form of recognition, acknowledgement coming to your, to your situation. I, that's what I was getting, that you will prove your point here to someone. And this person will acknowledge that, yes, yes. Capricorn was right or the idea the Capricorn's idea was right that's right but it's draining something here it's draining it, it's making you tired I'm getting there is a need for you to kind of uh, take a step back and 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 recharge your batteries with this four of swords it might be a case Capricorn that you have very demanding job right and for instance you know during the weekends you find it very difficult to kind of to relax essentially because there is always something it's always something including that job that you are thinking about or it's playing on your mind or you are planning or you are have you have to prepare or you have a paperwork paperwork and 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 you might be you know kind of a it might you might find difficult to like detached at least for a moment from that from that uh, energy that that it's created at your at your at your workplace but um i'm seeing you here capricorn overall being very successful at the end you know with the with the chariot and the, and the world but with the four of swords and the hermit there is a spirit it might be kind of pointing out that might, there might be a need for you to kind of re take a step back, to take some time off. Or Of course, if you're able to do that, but overall, I'm seeing that for some of you, it might be a case that you've already been thinking about it. And if there is a possibility for you, you might decide to do that because you are entitled to do it, right? But um, yeah, I'm seeing you Capricorn um, being tired, tired. It must be, there is a thing also, you know, that you might be focusing very much, some sort of project. With the Hermit, it might be a case that you are, uh, you are like a, you are the one who is responsible for this. And it's just taking your energy taking your time it's it's very kind of a it's demanding um, to be to be precise about something dedication and and patient and being again precise what do you, you are you are in this hermit energy you are very wise it's showing up here capricorn that you know exactly what you're doing you know your field and overall you can expect either way after a period of some sort of difficulty or exhaustion and you being tired, you can expect um, a victory here, success. But I'm seeing there is a particular person in your close related environment represented by this King of Swords energy that can be quite demanding, difficult and sometimes cold, meaning you might be feeling what well, this person doesn't understand. It's just they don't get it that, you know, um, for instance, people are, um, you know, have have life outside the work, right? 
this is someone who's very kind of demanding but as i mentioned before i'm seeing some of you taking some time off because you are entitled to do it so you might be thinking of taking some time going somewhere i see travel with the chariot in the world uh, yeah I'm, I'm getting sunbathing <laughs> very nice but overall things will get better things will get better here yeah. you have success and again proving your point <laughs> someone this king of swords would acknowledge that yes you were right and i feel it will be like a major triumph you know like personal satisfaction when it comes to money situation with the hermit and the four of swords i'm seeing you being very wise with your spendings no, I'm, with, with the four of swords it might be a case that for some of you you might came into conclusion that for instance this month uh, it might not be wise to spend more on something you know something like this is showing up and because of your wise decisions things will be just fine okay so let's see your close related environment Capricorn let's see could you please show Close related environment. Capricorn's close related environment. Family, friends, relatives. Too many. One more, please. Okay. So there is some sort of very strong transformation, transition, shift happening. Seven of Wands someone here it's making a very strong and kind of final decision you might be dealing with scorpio this is card number 13. right so let's see why the seven of wands and the card number 13 please we have temperance you might be dealing with sagittarius so this is a family situation okay oh yes we have the hanged man and we have a hierophant so we have pisces energy and we have and we have also card number 15 at the bottom of the deck okay that card number 15 devil energy so you might be dealing with pisces i also have taurus energy with the hierophant peace a tranquility it's coming into some sort of family situation here capricorn i'm getting very strongly that someone is uh, kind of in metaphorically saying freeing themselves from a very toxic and draining situation for some of you this is someone who who was married to to someone who who was quite controlling because we have a hierophant which is a higher level of commitment we have a card number 15 at the bottom of the deck as overall energy and card number 13 some something here some sort of form of an ending uh, might be happening or happened or this person yeah someone here wants to detached i'm getting someone it might be a case capricorn that this is like a family member or relative with the temperance why because we have infinity sign and infinity sign is it's it's sign of ancestral uh, energy therefore this is it might be a relative or um, family member i'm getting very strongly that it it has been a very very challenging and difficult relationship this person at, at some point might felt being stuck stuck in this situation and I'm getting someone who is very controlling very controlling they know best they 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 feel that they should that they they, they actions shouldn't be questioned very autocratic energy with this card it might be a case that someone here has unhealthy attachments 
someone created codependency, it might be a case that this person uh, was very controlling when it comes to finances. Therefore, they made an, another person kind of dependent on them financially with the Hierophant and the Devil. Seven of Wands. Here is the thing. This person is standing up for themselves. And with this particular card, I'm seeing the end of this very kind of difficult situation here, Capricorn. If this is your situation, because it might be a case, please take it how it resonates for you. I'm seeing you um, detaching from a quite toxic uh, connection here. Yeah. And with the Hierophant, it might be a case for some of you that you are or you were married with this person or you were in a higher level of commitment, long-term relationship, children might be involved. This is something official with a Hierophant. That's why we have here new relationships showing up for you because something here ended or it's ending. It's in the middle of, it's like a pro process. It's happening. Mm -hmm. Yeah, detaching. But if it's not your case here, Capricorn, I'm seeing here that indeed uh, it can be a case that a uh, family member or your relative, it's ending a very, very complex and difficult uh, partnership here with someone because someone here has been uh, hard work. It's been too much. This person is standing up for themselves with the Seven of Wands. They are protecting their views with the temperance. They, that this balance will be regained, you know, because we have, look, 13, number uh, 14, there is a progress. So things going to Devon Lope in a, in a, I, I'm getting very strongly in a, in a direction that this person here wants. I'm getting someone who just wants to detach because it's been too much. It's been too draining someone here. It might be a case that someone that this, this, this person represented by this energy has narcissistic tendencies, you know, someone who very, very controlling, but I'm seeing end of this situation, complex situation and this person restoring they, um, it's like moving into calmer times, calmer waters. Everything will start falling into place. So this is very positive because it's essentially showing that something that has been very difficult, challenging, draining, quite toxic, will come to an end. And this situation will, the, the like outcome of this situation will, will restore balance in someone's life. Could you please show me an uh, overall potential outcome for, for the near future, for the immediate future for Capricorn? Could you please show me potential outcome? Yes, yeah, Seven of Swords. Sneaky energy, someone light. This is someone who is wearing a mask. It might be a case that when they are, for instance, if it's a family situation, right? And this person is around, they are very charming, you know, uh, they are people's person, they are very nice, but behind closed doors, this is someone completely different. This person lied, they manipulated situation, they had secrets. Someone who cannot be trusted. Let's see, could you please show me potential outcome for the immediate future? We have a six of pentacles. For Capricorn and we have thank you eight of swords okay so why is that why is that why the six of pentacles and eight of swords why the six of pentacles and eight of swords emperor will of fortune yeah what they're giving me here Capricorn is like a message don't the, the sky it's a limit don't limit yourself don't don't let people think that your potential has a limit 
okay with this eight of swords we have a knight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck we have a nine of cups and we have the seven of swords that wanted to show up okay so capricorn you might be dealing with aries i also have more fixed energy taurus aquarius and leo scorpio um what i'm getting here capricorn is that someone here might tell you that something it's impossible for them to do because their hands are tied and i'm getting here with some sort of for instance it might be a case for some of you that if you maybe you've asked for some sort of help or support here with please take it how it resonates for you this person will come and say um, that with the eight of swords they are unable to do that because at the moment their hands are tied. Please take it how it resonates. Okay. With the Emperor and the Will of Fortune, Knight of Pentacles, I'm saying here, I'm seeing here, Capricorn, that no matter of what sort of circumstances you might be at the moment, or if if that's the case, that indeed there is someone here who you've asked for assistance, and this person would say, Well, I can't do anything about it with the Eight of Swords. Uh, spirit is saying here that it's it doesn't matter because at the end of the day the will of fortune will spin mm, to your advantage but it might take some time okay we have this knight of pentacles because this is the slowest moving knight but slow and steady win the race with the emperor this is again more passive energy you are here taking back control i'm seeing capricorn you know exactly what you want and you want some sort of form of fulfillment, dream come true. I'm seeing you that you have your eyes on the prize. And you are very careful. You are very careful because with the seven of swords, I feel that you are very careful and you have your eyes wide open when it comes to... Uh, people surrounding you with regards to this particular goal i'm seeing you keeping uh cards very close to your chest there is someone i'm getting that you might that might be your friend and you shared here some sort of plan or something that you really want to achieve okay goal and i'm seeing again that this person might say i can't do anything about it at the moment because of this this and that okay my hands are literally tied spirit is saying it doesn't matter because uh, this is something fated and this is yours and what it's yours it's yours it, it it will it won't be forgotten by the universe it will be delivered to you because this is something that you deserve but again it might take some time okay but it will manifest itself spirit is kind of advising you to stick uh, to this plan or to this goal to not give up to keep going because you have a nine of cups you will achieve it whatever you're focusing on or whatever you really truly want for some of you it might be a relationship for some of you it might be a career situation for some of you it might be a financial situation you know family um hobby what uh, you know i don't know it can be a even um um relocation you know please take it how it resonates for your situation but what they're showing me here overall that you do have your eyes on a prize you have some sort of goal you want something here this dream come true to finally manifest and you are very wise here capricorn to to keep to kind of keep your um keep your keep these cards very close to your chest and not share much with others this is very clever i feel you are very selective with this especially when it comes to energy with others because uh, you just don't want to kind of risk 
this to kind of um you don't want to risk this to that it can fail you know something like this is showing up and by by keeping uh, this you know this plan for yourself it is like a reassurance that uh, you fully in control here and you are with the emperor spirit wants you to know that even if someone or something here will occur in the immediate future with regards to this particular matter and you might feel that or someone i'm getting very strongly that someone will say my hands are tight i can't do anything about it at the moment some time has to pass something like this spirit wants you to know that this is something destined this is yours and you will achieve it keep going stick to your plan to your goal whatever the case might be because even it even if it if it requires more time it will manifest in the form of nine of cups which is a wish fulfillment happiness and joy it's yours but it might take some time but it's advisable for you to keep you know your cards very close to your chest to, to not share much with regards to this particular situation with others capricorn i would leave it here thank you so so very much for being with me please like share and subscribe and once again thank you very much for your time i truly truly appreciate you capricorn have, have a have a fabulous wonderful fantastic day and once again thank you so very much for being with me and for your time thank you capricorn take care bye